Good morning students. Hope you all are fine and enjoying your online classes. Let's come to the lesson. We know that computer is an electronic device that has the ability to store, retrieve and process data. Nowadays, we are using a modern computer that provides many features. But the evolution of, com of this complex system started around 1940 with the first generation of computer and evolving ever since. There are five generations of computers. Today, we are going to cover the first generation of computer. First generation of computer from 1940 to 1956. The first feature of the first generation computers is these computers made use vacuum tubes for circuitry and magnetic drums of memory. Vacuum tubes are electronic device that controlled the flow of electrons in a vacuum. Next feature, they were extremely large in size and released massive amount of heat. Third feature, these computers used machine language only and were limited to solving one problem at a time. Computer can't understand program languages directly. So machine language is a code language that can be understood by a computer easily. Fourth feature Punched cards and paper tip were used as an input device, whereas output was in the form of printouts. Punched cards Punch card is a piece of strip paper that can be used to contain digital data. You may have seen punch, punching machine. Holes may be punched by hand or by machine to represent the computer's data and instructions. Paper tip. It is a form of data storage that consists of long strip of paper in which holes are punched. Fifth feature. These computers were very expensive. Let us glance through some devices of the first generation. Mark 1 Mark 1 was designed by Howard Aiken in collaboration with IMB and installed at Herbert in 1944. It was 51 feet long, weighed 5 tons and consists of about 7,50,000 separate parts. So you can guess how big it is. It used paper tape readers, card readers, punch cards, tape readers, typewriters to carry out input and output functions. It was built to solve advanced mathematical problems automatically and was also known as Automatic Sequence Controlled Calculator. The short form is ASCC. ENIAC 
with full form of ENIAC is Electronic, Numerical, Integrated and Computer. That was world's first general purpose electronic digital computer invented by John Mauchley and John Presper Eckert and the University of Pennsylvania in 1946 for assistance in Second World War. ENIAC was made up of around 18,000 vacuum tubes. It weighed 30 tons and covered an area about 1800 square feet. It could perform 5000 additions, 357 multiplications or 38 divisions in just one second. Can you imagine the power of this machine? In just one second it can perform multiple tasks. ETSAC. The full form of ETSAC is Electronic Delay Storage Automatic Calculator. It was constructed by Maurice Wilkes and his team at the University of Cambridge in 1949. It is considered to be the first electronic computer that implemented the stored program concept. It came into being before the completion of EDVAC. It was made to perform its first calculation on May 6, 1949. UNIVAC 1 UNIVAC 1 the full form of UNIVAC 1 is Universal Automatic Computer. It is world's first commercially available computer. It was also developed by the same person who developed ENIAC, that is John Mauchley and John Pisper Eckert, in 1951. It weighed around 8 tons, used 5000 vacuum tubes and could perform 1000 calculation in a second. It used an operator keyboard, typewriter and magnetic tape for input and output operations.